welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome to my channel. Plain analog watch or very smart smartwatch? In this review, we dive into the ins and outs of the new Garmin Vivo Move HR. The Vivo Move HR features a stainless steel housing with a chemically strengthened glass front to make a smart looking waterproof watch. To the passerby, this looks like a simple analog watch. But when you flick your wrist, or double tap the screen, you'll see that there's far more to it than that meets the eye. Garmin's latest hybrid watch has a hidden digital screen underneath the plain look. This screen covers a small portion of the watch face, and can only be seen when it's on, meaning power is saved and the look is not affected by a bright glaring screen. This feature is very neat, but it gets neater. The hands move out of the way of the screen, while it's on. This means that you can see the screen properly without the hands in the way. Once finished, the hands move back to the correct time automatically. The watch connects to Garmin's Connect app to process and provide detailed information about your sleep, exercises, steps, stairs and more. The screen can be used to display simple information readouts too. Supporting Android, iOS and Windows phones this watch is compatible with most smartphones around today. The display can be used to show several performance stats. Stress, heart rate, messages, weather, music, calories, active time, stairs, steps, and of course the time and date. The watch also performs many other tasks, such as setting activities, be it cardio, weights, or anything else. Do not disturb. This only turns the notifications off on the watch, not your phone. Alarms. This includes a stopwatch, timer, and alarm clocks. The alarm clock vibrates your watch, which is quite a nice way to wake up. VO2. Broadcast heart rate to Garmin devices. Find phone this simply rings your phone, a history of activities, sync, and settings. This watch can track heart rate, altitude, and VO2, allowing you to monitor sleep, stress, walking, running, cardio, strength, and other activities. The official battery life of this watch is five days in smart mode, and two weeks additional in watch mode, low battery mode. This means that the watch will effectively work as a basic analog watch when the battery dies, meaning that you'll still be able to see the time for two weeks after the smart section of the watch has stopped working. I've actually found that I get around seven days in smart mode before it went into watch mode, which is very good for a smart watch with so many functions. This watch has three sensors, a heart rate monitor, an accelerometer, and an altimeter, measuring altitude. It is waterproof, so it's resistant to splashes, rain or snow, showering, swimming, diving into the water, snorkeling up to 50 meters. There's a full list of activities in which it can and can't be used on the Garmin website. The watch has two wireless communications. One of them is Bluetooth and the other is a, a Garmin propriety thing called ANT+, allowing it to connect to other Garmin devices. It has an OLED display with 64 by 128 pixels. The only flaw that I have currently found with this watch is the bulky strap holder. This digs into my wrist, although I've found this on several watches, so it could just be me. Analog or smartwatch? This watch gives you the best of both worlds. With an array of cool features, great battery performance, and a light housing, this watch is great for all ranges of activities. A premium version, is also available for those looking for a more expensive and sophisticated look. 